Yes, Oscar. So while there has been no official response from Kyiv, the attacks in Russia, these these drones attacks, uh, attacks that you've mentioned, are indeed being celebrated by the uh, residents of Ukraine and certainly here by the residents here in Kyiv. Now, of course, this uh, these attacks signals Kyiv's willingness to take this battle, so to speak, to the heart of Russia. However, as we've heard already from the U.S. Secretary of State, Anthony Blinken, the U.S. is not encouraging these uh, these uh, these uh, these attacks. And of course, uh, these these homemade weapons or these uh, these Ukrainian drones that are being used are uh, indicative that the Ukrainians are not completely relying on the West's supplies anymore. They are determined to hit back uh, on, on Russia, uh, especially in their continued weaponization of winter, uh, as, as we've seen, and, and of course in the continuous strikes on the energy grid in Ukraine. Kyiv has not claimed responsibility for these attacks, but however, those drone strikes over the past days are being celebrated in Ukraine by Ukrainian civilians and of course here uh, uh, by residents in Kyiv. Now, of course, this, uh, th these, these series of drone strikes are indicative of Kyiv's willingness to to uh, take the uh, the battles to, uh, to to the heart of Russia, so to speak. Now, of course, this comes uh, after weeks of relentless attacks by the Russians on Ukraine's energy grid. Of course, as you can see behind me, the temperatures in Kyiv and the cities across Ukraine are dropping, but millions of people uh, remain without utilities, without heating or electricity, um, and, 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 and this is being seen as a reason to strike uh, uh, Russia. However, as I mentioned, Kyiv has not taken uh, any responsibility uh, of these attacks. But uh, as you heard the U.S. Secretary of State say, the U.S. does not condone these acts. However, they do say that the Ukrainians are, of course, uh, in, uh, uh, allowed to defend themselves, to take action for themselves. Now, bear in mind that NATO has not provided uh, the Ukrainians with any long-range missiles so far. So these attacks, if they are indeed uh, carried out by the Ukrainians, are um, a sign that the Ukrainians are taking matters to their own hands.